Good morning, good afternoon, good evening or good night depending where you are on the planet. My name is Raccoon and welcome to The Rack is Back. So how are you people? It's been uh, quite a while since my last video. Yes, phone, I will be at, uh, I will answer you later. Now I'm talking to my people. Yeah, you can wait. <laughs> ah, so guys, it's gonna be, uh, well, it's, it's not gonna be my last video, but today what I want to show you, it's about the journal. Uh, what you can do with it and everything that goes with the journal that you find uh, exactly where you start the game. I didn't do it in that series, so I will do it right now. So let's get to it. So basically when you start you're uh, in front of uh, one of those uh, entrants there and somewhere on the road there should be a book. See? Proof. I got some but um, I don't have it all. So basically um, the books, I'm going to pause that, basically the books are uh, two um, do your end game uh, because you're gonna need uh, certain things um, to be able to quit the game the right way okay so that's why uh, basically uh, the books are there so we'll check them out one by one so we see uh, it, it says here I do have the number two. Wait, what? Seriously? I'm talking, guys. Uh, so it says uh, second floor of the research center. Um, and that's where I am going right now after I got all those tiny zombie killed. Okay, Mama, don't touch me. Now there's going to be a few more. Uh, the pink one, the arrow one. Okay. So now I need to go to the research center. Uh, basically, it's going to be that one here, if I remember correctly. And now I'm right there. So I'm going to go straight to there and we'll find out. Because every single place after that, you're going to have to find um, things that you will need for escaping the game. I would say it's a little bit far, but I will have to run and do a few things in the game uh, to do that. Die. Also, I will make another video about see that survival note that I have right now. Uh, would say top right corner. Uh, I will make a video about uh, that survival note. And I would do also a video about uh, the wave 100, like you see here, I'm at 77, day 77. There's a thing that you should know, uh, guys, that Night of the Dead, even if you play like, uh, I don't know, a thousand days in Night of the Dead, the wave it's gonna be the same as the day 100 so after the 100 i mean the wave will be exactly the same uh the zombie will be the same amount um so i did a bit of modification on my base um i added the rocket launcher it's going to be, and I used those 30 uh, windmills there to uh, 
no not even 30 those 30 windmills are for something else but as you can see i put my rocket launcher over there with um, a controller just in case i do have the resources uh, i do have everything in hand to be able to put a lot of defense uh, like i said i've been doing all those um mines over and over and over um and my chests are pretty full actually so what can i say about uh, while i'm going to that uh, research facility what can i do to uh, tell you exactly what can be done in the game some uh, tips that you can uh, oh they used to have an entrance here yeah that's right now they put fence all over the place oh that's right that was my the first place that i've been yeah and man it's been like 70 something days <laughs> So they say a uh, second floor. So go on second floor. And the book, uh, oh, I have a research bench here. So the book is right there, guys. But there's uh, something that you need to take. Okay, so I have an antenna right now, which is right there. And since I'm here, might as well uh, drop, 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 drop. And I killed also, uh, you know, a guy on my way there to start this video. So now uh, about the journal. Since I have the number one, I'm going to go to number two. Two, they're going to say a third room, a third floor of the hospital so the hospital it's not that far it's in town of course i didn't take the book because i did take the book uh while i was playing i guess but now i need to go to the hospital So I would say my first tip about this game would be customize it guys, customize it. It is um, a hard game so you need to learn I would say the basics, you need to learn the mechanics of the game to be able to, um, to drive into that, uh, in, into that game, uh, customize it. Uh, there's things and also if you play single player the map is huge it's really huge um, and um, by customizing it you know uh, if you use the uh, no generator no generator breakdown it will save you so many time uh, I mean a lot of time because all those wind turbines that i put up there uh, if i didn't put uh, that uh, generator breakdown no uh, generator breakdown i would spend all my day to go and fix them so there's things like that that it's you know kind of annoying annoying and if uh, there is a guy with you maybe if you play co-op uh, but the guy will have you know to to go and spend the whole day to fix them all the time okay uh, i guess it's not the right floor is it the one on top that's gonna be well that's the one below so a way to remember uh which floor it is it's with those uh, big doors okay so there, there is your uh, your book on the table 
and there's that microphone that you're gonna need so now since i did uh, of course a uh, research facility i've been uh, to the hospital now uh, the third one would be in the basement okay with that uh, said it is in the um, subway so we're gonna go to the subway and after that uh, while I'm going there I gonna tell you I would say uh, tip number two don't be afraid to try the game okay uh, don't be afraid you know to find you uh, find yourself an area uh, to build your base here it can be a good spot there's a wall all around but be careful if you build inside the police station the giant will step on that and will go over the fence so if you want to make sure that it doesn't happen Put walls okay put a wall on top of here where the bench are so they will have to go to the main entrance or see where that kind of square right there is where my handle is uh, all those things will make uh, a giant can go over the fence Oh, another copper thing. Yeah, you're dead. Okay, second floor, they say. I'm gonna go over here, go down here. It's gonna be on the right. Right there. So that's the book, and now you have the headset. So if I look at into my journal, uh, so it says uh, basement. So that's going to be now page four. Hey, uh, Tinzian, how are you? Now I have to go to the sec uh, second floor of the school, which is close of my base. I'm doing pretty good too, also. I've been uh, away for a couple of days. Uh, I had, uh, I would say, issue. <laughs> One of my followers uh, passed away, and um, well, I was following him. He was following me. Uh, the guy was a uh, few years younger than I am and he passed away the day that uh, the son of the forest came out so that kind of gave me a shot you know well uh, I didn't know the guy personally but uh, the thing that I enjoy with him, it was that since we were about the same age, uh, it was fun to talk with him because, um, you know, we, we talk about, uh, I would say, all the, uh, the thing that we saw, actually, uh, in life. Uh, the, we saw, you know, the black and white TV go to color. Uh, we saw the music go to... Uh, uh, 45 33 lp and after that was the it's, it was the cd and after that was the uh, mp3 and stuff so um yeah it it was nice to talk <laughs> with someone my age uh but uh it it's fun also to talk to you guys Yeah, black and white. Yeah, black and white. Ooh la la. 
Okay, now we're gonna go to the school. The school actually is it that way? I don't remember. Uh, no. I think uh, here. Yeah, the library. So you go here. There's gonna be the the globe. So there's the the other journal here, guys, and that's the globe. So then again, I'm gonna go and drop that 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 I don't need all that that's see here so right now I do have uh, the antenna the microphone the headset the globe okay uh, in order and now we're gonna go for page number five so if I'm page four here they're gonna say second floor uh, uh, of the school now we're gonna go and get uh, to the factory oh man that's far okay let me just check the map again to make sure that i go really fast okay good i'm not gonna go that way or I will put a, a marker like this. Um, the third tip I can give you guys. Um, yes, phone, I hear you. Um, the third tip I can give you is when you build okay uh, when you start the game uh, you won't be able to do all the surviving note so I will make a video about that and you will understand why you won't be able to do the survival note um, all at once that's impossible so just keep that in mind also um, I would say when you start the game you're gonna spawn near an entrance uh, just like I uh, I told you and if by any chance uh, you're doing your stuff and you find out that uh, zombies are coming from all around you coming down the mountains and coming that way and coming that way uh, that means that you are right in the middle of uh, a spawn point so get out of there find another area um, make yourself a tiny uh, base somewhere uh, there are a lot of places that you can uh, try to find your area to find your area and have a foot down but like i said remember that it's um you're gonna have to you know try it so this is the factory you know the first time i played guys i i was on that road right there there see there's an entrance that big door in the back so I started there and I played the co-op with one of my fr friend and I, I, I did use that house. Uh, we didn't have any fence at the time. Uh, so we put like a bunch of traps. Uh, we put a door here because if you put a wall with the door, it fits. Um, I used that as a, uh, we put like a few things in here, like uh, the bench here, it was the storage area. Uh, we put uh, some other bench in here wait what and oh seriously and uh, what happened is that uh, you know we played uh, we realized that uh, they what was it the five uh, we had that uh, crawler that explode and burn a few of uh, oh and there was a big truck here also um we had the garden inside that little punk 
Pangulia there. And uh, right there we put our garden here. We put wall all around. And um, come on. Big green thing. Okay, where are the two other? The archer and the perp, the pink one. Oh, they're coming from that way. Well, and the roof was flat. If I rem remember correctly, we were uh, jumping on here to be able to go on the over there. And uh, suddenly uh, the day uh, 9 to 10 kind of realized that first time we saw the giant. It was like, seriously, what the hell is that? And <coughs> we were shocked to see that, yeah. So now we are at uh, what we call here, it would be more the... Um, uh, you know power plant because of those uh, chimney here so if I remember correctly it's over here somewhere right there see right there So I'm gonna take the book, another page of the journal, and I will take that M Morse code machine. Okay, can I have, so I'm gonna go and check what is here. Oh, I have to go to the prison now. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, man, that's going to be a long way. Uh, that means the prison, the prison, the prison. Prison. Hey, uh, I'm talking. Prison. Would be... Right there, if I remember correctly, right there. So I'm gonna try to go directly. Oh no, 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 wait, what? Come on, remove that one uh, like this. Uh, first horde with the giant, it's always surprising. Yeah, 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 it is always, 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 always. Okay, that's part of the every single hour uh, four hour during the game there's gonna be a few that will attack you like this one I said this one now time to get out okay number two number two it's right there so I'm gonna try to go directly there and here I remember I did the base once uh, it's pretty flat there's a lot of trees I also went uh, near those big uh, chimney there and but I, I was like in a spawn area I did the overland run from the power plant to the prison and it was intense. <laughs> Everything here is intense. Yeah, there are uh, some giant. See guys, I, I did put some knives. Okay, so right there, there's going to be a giant. 
on top of that mountain but i'm going straight that way so i i, I won't see it there's a giant right around actually it all the big mountains all around the the town where you you spawn see there's a giant right here there's a giant right here there's another one right here and there's another one right there so right we're surrounded by giant on top of the mountain so if you want to build your base on top of a mountain uh you i think you you will you will have to uh to clear that giant So like I said, uh, the game is pretty rough, it's pretty tough, uh, and don't be ashamed, you know, try it. If you don't want to, to have hordes, or, you, come on, I know, come on, get down. I know I can climb if I go, okay, sideways, see? And um, so don't be afraid, try the game. Uh, if you don't want to have... Um, zombies you know you can deal with all that uh you want to try you know the building mechanics go for it um so that way you will be a good i have to go that way i guess or i can use the cheat code and fly come on you can climb, you can climb. Oh shit, I hate that. Oh, that's gonna be a big fall. Ouch, ouch. Not so bad. I'm able to, uh, you know, have the fall damage because I have a chance uh, once in a while to don't hurt myself if I jump uh, really high. But I do have also uh, like uh, uh, self-healing number two on me, so that helps a lot. <coughs> So I'm gonna go down there, take a tiny break uh, to let my uh, stamina come back and I'm gonna cross that thingy there. See, stamina is going fast too. So I did make sure that I do have a, go a good food on me so no it's not advertising it's um good food in the game see all those zombies and also guys remember those zombie can go underwater so if you build something on the other side they will swim on well they will walk See, my health, it went down, but it's going up. Because of my self healing. So, like I said, I will make... Uh, I know Omega Scar will do it one day uh, because I know uh, that uh, that guy was um, that passed away. Uh, a guy who was on Twitch uh, passed away, and he was a good friend of Omega Scar. 
I know uh, that they build a thing on satisfactory together uh, and I would have to say that MKBits and all those big guys could, you know, uh, learn from them because what they did, it was amazing, you know, and they didn't do that on, um, uh, you know, custom or cheat or have all the materials. Uh, they did it, uh, everything, they, they had to wait to have the stuff. To build the stuff uh to build their uh, base and all the that mechanics so i know that omega scar wants to uh pay tribute to his friend uh that played with him so i gonna make a small tribute to him because i like the guy too but uh, like i said o omega will do a couple of hours uh streaming also uh, about him me and omega we used to build also in co uh, in co-op right there okay that area it's pretty flat we had like the main entrance about here uh, we use all the top to put uh, trebuchet and that was the uh, seats flat over here. So we used that area, you know, to put our storage. We were able to go on top of that fence. And uh, what's wrong with my phone? Come on. It's Friday. Not working today. So uh, we used the, cor the courtyard uh, to put our uh, traps and stuff. So here since I never been here so I will have to kill a few ones of them definitely uh, where is that uh, where do you say it is second floor of the pri of the prison of the prison so it's maybe in I don't remember Okay, second floor. I don't remember where it was. I is it inside a cell? I don't. I don't think so. I think it's more. See, I'm doing it with uh, with you guys because I don't remember perfectly. Where it is? No, that's the top. It's not here. I know there's a. There used to have something on top over there, a desk. But now I have to admit that I'm kind of lost here because they don't say much. They don't say much. Okay. I do have a screamer. Okay, let's see again where it says we'll find an item near the second floor. Okay. So it might be not here, the second floor. Where is that screamer? I hate those. Yeah, there's a fence. So I have to go that way. There are not much building here with the second floor. Oh yeah, 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 now I remember.
But everything changed since last time I've been here. No, never had library. That used to be, yeah, a bad house. I'm discovering it with you guys. Where is that streamer again? Oh, you're coming through the fence, but I'm not. Oh, there's an opening there. Okay. Where is that book? Across the bridge, next building. In that one? Man, I don't remember. And since, you know, with that map, I never uh, went to, uh, you know, kind of look at the... Um... Let's go. We'll go back again. Maybe I missed it. Oh, you sucker. You're not gonna yell. Across the bridge. So it's not down here. I've been here, there's nothing. Man, how many the uh, I think it might be in a cell. I don't remember. I never uh, did those, uh, you know, those books with that new update. So Okay, that's a bridge that can, maybe here do they have like a second floor oh that looks familiar it's in a cell somewhere oh there it is ha 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 the journal and that mo mobile phone so no, no zombie around so let's go page 7 final feel okay well that uh first of all i will have to go to my base because what i want to do is uh, i need to craft stuff I will remove that marker here now, like this. Look at all those zombies, yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are part of the wave that you have every four, uh, uh, four hours in game. Uh, yeah, so if you move, they will catch, they will catch up.
Also, my last video that I put uh, for uh, YouTube was about the two last book that you can find, which are in that snowy, snowy area here. And uh, one of those books are for <clears throat> the um, how to build, you know, uh, lightsabers and stuff. And unfortunately, you know, I was able to, uh, to find a lightsaber here because if you look at the map i would say the map it's kind of div divided in a few sector uh that was the area when that was the old map okay around the, see the prison that uh factory over here that i just went to pick up i think was book five or six um but that is your starting point and don't be uh, afraid to explore that and look into houses and get all the coils and stuff. The second part uh, that they had was that area right here. I uh, will bring it a little bit bigger. That part. Okay. So in that area, there's going to be different mon monsters. Uh, but look at the road. The way it goes. It goes right there. It goes right there. It it keeps going now there's another area right here and it goes right there and that's another area see there's no bridge from where my house is to go over there and there's a reason why um, because every single area has different zombies uh, they're meaner they're tougher so yeah uh, you can use like a jet boat if you want to go but I don't recommend you to go as you start because you yeah you will have some difficulties So next uh, video will be uh, about uh, the um, the uh, how do you call that surviving uh, survival note. So I won't use that character since I have already um, starting it. So it is going to be a brand new character. Uh, and I will use, you know, the the cheat because if, uh, like I said, if you want to know, it, I don't think there's someone who already did a video about uh, those um, uh, survival note. Uh, but it, it, I would say it's impossible to do it uh, first night. Uh, really impossible. Be oh, lag. Guys, and also here it's a nice place to build a base. Uh, there's a lot of crocodiles, but uh, basically uh, if you build your base around that area, that's flat. Okay, there's uh, you can go fish out there. Um, look, look at that. Look at that where I am. There, the uh, polymer uh, thingy there, that's the... Uh, f um, uh, factory uh, the first book that I went and pick up but that area it's pretty flat and you have the water that you can use you know your jet ski to go around and yeah it's uh, it's a nice place it's flat uh, you can fish to have uh, to be able to pimp your armor uh, there's plenty of material and you're pretty close to town And now what I'll do is I go in town and to be able to, how, how can I put that, to be able to uh, go and escape the, the game, I uh, will need to make some uh, 
radio equipment. See, that's where I was, where uh, I put like uh, the first book that I picked up was right there. At least the the page of the journal are still in like the first map. But I have to admit that I forgot about the one at the, the prison there, the, or the jail. Okay, what, do I have something on me that I can, yeah, that, 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 I can throw it. So see, one, two, three, four, five, six item. I also put another wall in the back, um, like I did on that side also. I put another wall because I don't know exactly where the zombies spawn and I want them to go all the way around town instead to come directly on the side here. Uh, so yeah, oh, I need to go in the back. Okay, let's go M, no, uh, journal, sorry. There's an airfield. You can escape by fixing the broken communication equipment there. So basically what you have to do here, guys, uh, you have to go, I think it's in that one. That one. You need to build a speaker, a radio equipment, a radio, portable radio, and an amp. But see, uh, all that stuff that you need. So, I'm gonna start and doing that. I'm not going to escape the game. But I know I will need that, I will need that. That can I put? I just gonna take everything like this plastic, rubber, tape, just in case, gear, just in case. I know I'm gonna need uh, copper wire plates and stuff because if I look at it again and I go like this, see, I need plates basically copper wire and iron so we'll go like that here that's gonna be the no but that one that one gonna take a stack of that stack of that and a stack of that now radio I gonna make first speaker. Bam. Speaker. Portable portable radio. Bam. Radio equipment. B bam. Okay, now I need nails. I do have like a ton of those. So I have radio equipment, the amp, bang, and the radio, bang. Might as well. Put that all there.
and might as well to put that too and that so one two three four five six and five equipment like that so let's go I have enough time before uh, the daylight that's gonna come down I hope so now that you have all that equipment all that uh, radio equipment all those things that you found near your um, journal page you'll be set to end the game properly and also I remember the first time that I stream Night of the Dead like I said I was uh, uh, doing it with um, a, f a friend of mine um, and there was a game also that came out really really uh, not long time after I, I did start uh, streaming it was about a year ago and when we uh, stopped at the airfield uh, he said to me, he said, hey, uh, raccoon, look at that. And I went like, what? He said, look, there is something strange about that airfield. And he, um, he told me that, uh, look at the logo of the air airfield and the name. So that's where we're going and I'm gonna tell you the rest of the story there because it is some kind of weird, kind of weird. And we're about to be there. So that's the um, military base. There's a book there. There's another book at the hotel over there. But there's the airfield which is right there. See, there's a plane. Oh, uh, can I? Okay, I'm gonna go inside instead because it's uh, kind of weird. I'm gonna kill maybe the few zombies here because I don't want to be disturbed. Okay, here we go. Die. Perfect. So guys, this is where you gonna have uh, to build your your uh, equipment, okay? So if I see there's nothing but the desk ask you to uh, where is that? E? Where is my E? Why there's no nothing? Come on. Uh, remove that. Maybe if I pick it that up, no, no, okay, is that a bug? Let me just uh, say a quick save here. Uh, gonna go like this, gonna save. 
and I gonna reload. Okay, tell me that game is save. Come on, okay, game save. So let's go save and load. I gonna take that one and I gonna load. So basically here guys, it's where you put all that radio equipment and all you know that the globe and everything that's where you put it and after that you press e and it says like do you want to quit the game or escape the game and uh you say yes so this is how you you will have to um when it's gonna come back online please uh, man my computer is pretty slow i need a new one yeah that's gonna be my next uh, christmas gift only nine months to wait okay Okay, can I see it now? Why it doesn't show it to me? Uh, maybe if I need to use that? I have the radio part. I have all those four, uh, six things. Okay, let's go and, uh, not M, but Page seven, you can escape by fixing the broken communication equipment there. There's an airfield, okay. I am, see that's the hotel right there. I am at the airfield. That used to be the desk. Unless they change it. And it doesn't look like it. There's no more desk. But what I wanted to say, guys, it's look at that. Icarus. The red tool. man thanks 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 um you know when i was playing last season uh we didn't have to use that perfectly 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 thanks <laughs> thanks leo um thing change so see, uh, you have that antenna, that microphone, the headset, the globe, uh, the uh, Morse code thing, thingy there, uh, the mo mobile phone. And we did build all those at the base. So if you upgrade that. Uh, I don't know the name of his tool in English. Uh, I would say it's a uh, man. You ask me something here also because I'm French, but it is a, a wrench, uh, a pipe wrench. Usually a plumber uh, used to have that, but uh, yeah. And now, now, uh, if I put it away, see, it says communicate. So if you press communicate, uh, it's, uh, you will be able to escape the game, but that's gonna be for another video guys uh, but since it's 20 o'clock well let's go Dougie dead might as well go back home but what I wanted to say here uh, basically it look at that Icarus Airways that's something that I really uh, find funny 
because when I was playing the game and I on my first uh, series on YouTube uh, I came across that and not long time just before I, I came across that there was a, a game that came out in December I would say 2021 20, or something like that and it was Icarus but look at that it's Icarus and look at the crest or logo kind of a wing but if you look into um, games on Steam and you look at that uh, Icarus game I mean the logo it's pretty pretty much the same so oh, seriously Where is that? Cock screamer. Oh, you're here, eh? So I guess I'm gonna put the bonus here. I'm gonna go back to my base and um, let's see the wave. But yeah, guys, uh, I must go. Well, Leo, it was nice, and, and thanks for, <laughs> for the info. <laughs> thanks, thanks, man. So, uh, if you look to your uh, Steam games or whatever, guys, look at Icarus game, okay? It's, it's the same name, and the logo, it's pretty much the same. I know it's not the same dev, okay, but uh, the thing is that I kind of fi find weird is, oh, man, I killed you, you piece of shit. Uh, the thing I found kind of strange about this game and the Icarus game is that you here you're in a city there's a bunch of zombies going around you now you take Icarus Airways to quit the game to go it and it, it sounds logical you you start playing Icarus, you're in a, a planet, you have to build everything from scratch again, except it's uh, there's going to be like a bunch of animals, some are tougher than others, there's no life like human life, but the, the animals had some kind of muted a tiny bit so yeah it's kind of weird uh to me it's it, it, to me it's like it's the the second part of night of the dead uh i know the dev are not the same they're not coming from the same area or same place but to me it's kind of weird especially that they use that same name it's really, 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 really weird. And again, uh, thanks to Leo, uh, because <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Yeah. I never thought uh, I, I'm not sure, but I think uh, when I used to play that game, uh, when it was just uh, well the small map or before the update uh, I don't remember it's maybe totally my, my mistake but um, I I never thought to use that wrench or hammer to be able to you know <laughs> do that and fix that that table that r radio station but uh, yeah Thanks, Leo. I kind of, uh, I'm ashamed a little bit here. <laughs> so, 
See, that proves that I don't know everything. And I can forget things. So let's go. We're gonna do a little something here pretty fast. Open that. Close that. Remove that. Look at my inventory. I don't need I don't need that, that, and that. Definitely not. My stuff is full. Gonna turn that light off. And let's go. Have fun. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna turn that uh, 77 to 80, uh, 78. So that's gonna be giant. I go, let's go put that also on heavy. Yeah, I do have, <laughs> look at that guys. I mean, that rocket launcher is full. Um, no problem there. But it, I think it is a little bit too far. But it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. So what I'll do here. I will, I will use the sandbox to bring that up to, uh, I would say, uh, to have the wave right now. So let's go. Gonna go like this. Yes, I want to enable it. Uh, gonna go like that. See, I'm not going to use that. I just gonna go and start wave. Start wave. Uh, I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna go like this. And I'm gonna go like that. And now I, do, I don't have any more uh, that cheating code, but it's midnight. Oh, I forgot to light up also uh, those things. Yep, giant. You can see in the back, you know, those uh, ballista. They went up. I'm gonna go like this. See, that thing's still shooting. It starts shooting. That's the, This is good. Because there won't be a lot of people coming in. Oh, holy crap. Can I go higher and have a look? Man, that survival note, it's always in my way. I had so many copper, so many iron, 
that I was able to load that thing at full capacity and I think I have like 28 more in the, the box but that can do damage for heavy zombie and it's not gonna use those 250 in, in it but the thing that I'm concerned is those guys oops ouch how come I get see those guys with blue dots uh, those guys are immune to uh, plasma shokers um, and I want to have them you know to make sure that they go to my treadmills here uh, and I want a couple of them to go over there so what I'll do off camera I will bring up that to level I would say level 99 D99 to have a wave the maximum wave that I can get which gonna be day 100 and with that well we'll see if my base can uh, I, I might do have to make more ballista at the front but so far guys that base can stand um, my customized game and also there's uh, another thing that I saw from different uh, viewer, uh, YouTubers and stuff um, their comp some, some of those guys have better com computer than I have and they're lagging like hell uh, because they're put that to le legendary and I mean the frames are or horrible um, I think that the dev should make sure that we're able to play the game at full capacity for some of us that are used to play the game but um, for me for the purpose of the video see I'm only at that at 450 percent it's not much uh it was like at 399 uh, i think when i started that i br i just brought it up a tiny bit but uh hey sun jazz and um yeah but like i said uh, every single day there's gonna be more zombie they're gonna be meaner and meaner by the day uh, and the maximum wave or the maximum zombie that you will get it's gonna be day 100 so after that if you're for instance like day 200 something it's the same wave that day 100 well the yeah exactly i mean if if you put like the wave the amount of zombies and stuff like that you know sometimes when you go into a town and you know it's you kind of get stuck and the computer come back uh, after a few seconds it's uh, it's because the the amount of data that it has to process for instance here the metro it's uh, it's empty the hospital it's empty and I didn't put uh, when I customize my game that the zombie you know when you kill it it's dead okay uh, they don't respawn and that helps a lot so imagine when you have legendary you put uh, like full zombie uh, man your your game's gonna lag it's gonna really lag badly so maybe you know the, the game it's uh, it's not completed okay uh, yeah and also uh, some jazz I put some uh, rocket uh, well one rocket launcher over there um, 
but yeah and I would say don't try it le uh, le legendary for now or the full amount of zombie because you will swear believe me about the game um, it's gonna be really 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 tough for your computer Uh, and now, uh, yeah, and you're talking about the giant. Yeah, uh, basically, like I said, guys, to me, the giant in the game right now are useless. Uh, why am I say that? Saying that? Uh, let's go first, uh, not first view, but like this, and I will tell you why. When you kill a giant, you have a chance to have. Where is that? I know I put some in here. Chip, okay? You have chip like this. But what are the chip for? Of course, to make yourself a lightsaber uh, and maybe other stuff. But the thing is that when you look at your skill point, the that fu uh, f futuristic weapon and, and things like that, that make your lightsaber and your light shield you know that it's part of the last book that you're gonna find over there and I was able to find a lightsaber in the desert so there's I mean there's no sense to me to put giant unless you want to have a challenge in the game because uh, giant yeah they will destroy your base really really quick A uh, rocket launcher would be empty in no time in my game when having it <laughs> set like you. Well, it's uh, my rocket launcher. It's on um, heavy zombie right now and giant. But and that helps me for my uh, you know for that. Uh, but the thing is, I will just put it on giant. Uh, later on because I want to see uh, you know those uh, I don't have but I'm gonna take my wrench and put myself on first view I want to have like the you know those big guy with blue dots uh, coming on top go there and use that treadmill I want to tr to see them fall back inside like that never ending uh, trap trepiting but so far uh, like I said my rocket launcher is full of ammo and it's uh, two o'clock right now I'm mean, gonna go up there maybe to have a better view So guys, to me, there are still like, I would say two video to make about uh, that uh, Night of the Dead uh, tutorial series that I make. I will make another video about the survival note. Okay. Uh, I don't know if there's anyone uh, on YouTube that went all the way to make that survival note um, back to back so for that unfortunately I will have to create a new character so and I gonna use the uh, the cheat because I and I will explain to you a lot of stuff about that uh, the survival note there I mean it's impossible to make it to finish it the first day and I think there is some missing information about that uh, and I will tell you all this because I did it already uh, by myself and I gonna tell you what I found about that that it's kind of weird but uh, I will make a video about that I will make a video about uh, the the wave a hundred so that's gonna be to me my biggest wave uh, in the game 
and there's going to be maybe one or two giant maybe three i don't know because i put the giant uh, like almost zero um because to me like i said in the game they're useless uh they give you the chips yeah uh but the book for making those lightsaber thing it's kind of too too far in the game because i think i found like 15 lightsaber before i went to get the book so to me like i said the the giant are useless unless oh i saw that treadmill work Yeah, I mean, I don't mind people if they want to have a challenge, uh, they put the giant on. It's okay, you can remove that if you want to. Um, for the challenge to kill like a, bill, a big beast, uh, I would say yeah, definitely yes. Um, also, how to maybe improve your defense yes that it's uh it's a nice way i mean to to know uh if you can kill at least the giant uh from afar uh not letting them going inside your base but besides that um bef except for that challenge thing in the game they're useless if you want to farm giant to have the chip and build yourself lightsabers i mean just remove the giant because uh it's not a good point uh, like i said the book it's the last book right there uh, and i had lightsabers right there in the desert so i mean and even even that snowy area uh i know there's different type of zombie over there uh but uh and there's a book over here also i don't remember which one it was but uh, maybe i can go right here i know it was in the skill points oh it was the master uh, vehicle uh engineer okay that was uh, the one in that big hole, hole. and that one was uh, for the lightsaber and light shield so master vehicle it was that one here and uh, for the lightsaber it's that one right there so i think to me it's a little bit weird uh like I said, to have that, since I can have lightsaber right there, you know, uh, <coughs> really, really uh, mid game. So, and I mean, the game, it's not complete. Uh, to me, the game, it's not complete. Um, there's still a few bugs or, sorry. Um, a few things that are kind of missing but for a solo player the map is I would say too big uh, for co-op I would say it's good but basically I mean I love the game I I love the game. I I really do love the game. It's a it's a nice game. Uh, I know it's not complete right now. Uh, they do have issue with the um, that. I mean, it's always flipping all the time. So it may be the same with uh, with that one. there's also not much um thing about uh, you know that uh oil engine maybe 
if they can put something about you know we're pumping oil right in there with those machine maybe they could add something about um making oil and stuff like that and there also another thing that i know that i was able to discover how to make that ray gun work with a certain kind of wiring uh, of course i had help uh, from uh, I, I i did find how to make the wiring uh but my thing it's overkilled uh omega scar uh told me that there's a way to plug i i'm uh, the input in there and again there why a controller have five input and only one output S -s that was the first thing that came to mind why why it's pos why that thing uh, has five input and only one output that's from there that I scratch my head and I went like, hey, it should be like one input and five output. You know, if I want to put like five, uh, uh, five thingy, why can I do that? Or why there is five input? Because the one in the back, it's the main one. And the other one can be used as a secondary input for power. And that's why i came up with the de well the design of that the xor the way to uh, to, to plug it and uh, so and after that when i found out one of my dev uh, in my discord say ah oh, uh, there's some guy who did it I sent a video to uh, Omega Scar and Omega Scar said, well, that guy, uh, I know him, he is the tester from the game for Night of the Dead. But, problem, he did everything with a generator and solar panel. And to me, that is shit. Because solar panels don't work at night. They work during the day. And if you put a generator, well, I mean, that thing is going to consume so much fuel that you're going to spend your, your day just to be beside it. So I came up with a plan to put that all electric. And it works. Well, it works. But it works more than one but it still need a little tweak and that's where a megascar came and also i had the, the help uh man what was his name again what was his name again cherry cherry um a french guy from uh, france uh and he did some test and it works but still there's a uh, that thing never will work at full capacity so maybe maybe I don't know if the if if the dev or the tester of the dev can listen to me one day um, maybe with the chip I don't know, put a, like an Easter egg or something like that. Uh, uh, killed, uh, for instance, uh, uh, 20 giant. Uh, put uh, 20 chip plus, I don't know, something else. And you will get how to hook up the railgun. Because right now, the railgun, uh, even if I cr crack the code... Uh, without cheating about that and the help uh, of a few friends I mean the ray gun it's not meant to be working 
why is that i don't know but why you're gonna give me a rifle and you don't put ammo in the game so that's why i think that there may be a way uh for the dev to put like a page of a journal for instance and explain the the wiring or uh, c put like a uh, design the ray gun over there puts the xor the way and also you need to put that and that there's a way to plug that thing in i mean <laughs> it's crazy crazy look at that the batteries uh, that i have goes in one of that okay the output uh goes in the bottom the top one there goes to there and the other one goes to there and i mean it's crazy uh it's a crazy wiring but i mean that can be put inside of a journal somewhere or maybe uh find a page somewhere uh, I don't know there may be some way that we can make that work if the dev will allow it but besides that yeah that would be nice I mean why you put a gun that we're not able to use and that thing man that that destroy <laughs> that destroy a lot of stuff anyway so that's what I think the game is really great uh you can do whatever you want uh, see i don't even have my bed or my bedroom and you know all that nice uh thing right there you know i have nothing done about that so i still have my sleeping bag and that's it that's it so for today guys it I gonna be uh, that's gonna be the end of this video and uh, I hope uh, that I will uh, see you soon for my next one uh, next one I won't use that character no 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 I won't use uh, this one because um, I will do the uh, survival note and I will say a few things about that and after that my last video will be like wave 100 and also since we did put the thing uh at the airport we will escape the game and that's gonna conclude uh of course that uh series of tutorial about night of the dead so how i hope that you enjoyed